Hello everybody and welcome to another unboxing video and today's item that we've got here What is this you say? This is a portable CD player with uh, Anti-shock function now. I am not gonna say what kind this is I'm just gonna open it up. It is by hot It's been hot since 1999 Now let's take a quick little glance at that. Oh look at that wood finish now you're probably thinking, why did you get it? You can get digital, all that. Well, I have a bunch of CDs along with my wife, and we love nostalgia. You know, being able to use these and everything like that, you know, way back in the day of using these. Now, it does have a protective film on there, as you can see here. This is the peel-off thing. We're not going to peel that off yet. Um, there is an open and close function here. You slide this. And as you see, it pops open. And then you place your little CD inside there, close it, let it spin up, then you start pressing play and reverse, whatever, and what it does is it spins up, reads the disc ahead of time, and it saves it in here, so when you're bouncing around, it's not trying to skip or anything like that. That is what the anti-skip function was back in the day. It does come with earbuds, pack of earbuds. It does come with a 3.5 millimeter adapter, so you can attach it to any kind of Bluetooth speaker or speaker in general. It does come with a cord to plug it in so that you don't need batteries. That was always one of the major sell points for these back in the day is making sure you had enough batteries for this. You would always go through batteries nonstop, left and right in this thing and it would always be a hassle. But nowadays, you can get USB chargers and stuff like that and get it spun up. So I just so happen to have a power supply right here so that we can get it spun up and everything get it turned on. So plug that in right there like so and power it on, where'd it go? There it goes, it is currently spinning up. It says disc. That's kind of cool. Back in the day, that's what you would do. Alright, so this little stop button right here. Oh, wait, no. Where'd it go? One of these was the on and off button. There it goes. Right here, the play button's the on button. That's the off button. Then you got uh, f forward, reverse... You've got the ASP function. You've got a bunch of different functions here. So, let's you read the user manual. CD player user manual. Alright, so it does have, like I showed off, it does have a volume up and down button. Now, there is, back in the day, there was no volume up, up and down button. There was a little dial you had to move. That was your way of dialing in your volume. Now it does have a hold. Um, this is to, uh, uh, sorry about that. This is to um, lock it so that it cannot be accidentally pressed on a button if you had it in your pocket. The hold button made sure that these buttons on the other side were not able to be pressed and made you miss or skip a song halfway through. So I know you guys are all probably like, why did you get this? Why did you get this? Why did you get this? Well, like I said before, nostalgia purposes. We used to have these back in the day. You know, they were a whole whole new craze. You know, if you ever wanted, you know, to have your music anywhere you wanted to go, this was the go-to instead of having one of those big, gigantic, you know, CD players. You could you can make it portable. So that was the top seller back in the day. Now it's all these, you know special like players and stuff like that and that's not a problem not a problem at all but to go back and look at the nostalgia of a CD player that's that's what you that's what's, what's nice about this is the nostalgia of it so I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys want some nostalgia as well or just have some CDs laying around the house that you want to use 
for like parties and stuff. This would be great for parties. Um, I will leave the link in the, down in the description if you guys want to get this for yourselves. Um, if you guys love this video, give it a thumbs up. If you did not, oh, no worries. If you guys want to make sure you get, if you guys want to make sure that you get uh, to see my newest next video, hit that subscribe button down below. If you guys want to get notified when I upload these videos here, make sure to hit that bell icon down below. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Bye.